Hi everyone, welcome to Tidbit Tuesday. Today we will be looking at meta titles and meta descriptions. What are they exactly and why are they important? So I'm sure all of you have actually seen a meta, meta title and description. If you're doing any sort of search on Google, Yahoo, Bing, any sort of search engine, all of the results that you see listed on the page are going to have a title and then a little blurb about the page they're linking you to. So that first line item is actually the meta title. And then the second, so the little blurb, is the meta description. And more than likely, your pages are just going to default to pulling in the actual title of the page and then the first 200 or so characters of body text that's listed. But we actually recommend you go in and customize uh, that text for as many pages as possible, uh, which you can do if you're using WordPress with a tool called Yoast. So what you can actually do is go into the edit snippet option that they have and there'll be a field for the SEO title and the description. So you can just start typing that in and it'll show you a little progress bar which is really nice. So it'll say, oh, you know, this looks like it's too short. Maybe you try to add too many characters. Or then this green bar is an example of knowing, okay, this is a good amount of copy to add here but it is up to you to determine what copy is most appropriate. So I'm gonna go back to that last slide real fast. So the title tags, that's a really great place to include service and location focused keywords. Obviously you want it to make sense and be relevant to the page itself, but that's kind of a general rule of thumb to follow. And then the description itself, really think of this as more of a call to action. So maybe you're listed as number three or four on the results page. When users are skimming those different results, you definitely want to stand out and make sure you're saying, hey, here's what this page is about. You know, really engage people and kind of use that as the hook to get them to want to click and learn more and actually visit the website. So I'm going to put a link down in the comments with more details uh, from one of our blog posts about how you can write these meta titles and descriptions. But if you have any questions in the meantime, let me know. Otherwise, I will see you at our next Tidbit Tuesday.